Hey guys, this is Lucas from Crypto Made Simple, and today we're looking at IOTA. Stay tuned. In July of 2016, IOTA's main network went live. Uh, since then, the price has jumped around a bit, and right now it's a little over a dollar per unit, and the units are measured in millions of IOTAs. It's been in use since 2015, and so far more than a billion dollars have been transferred using it. So it's a pretty big deal. But what is it exactly? IOTA is a new distributed ledger technology designed to improve on the current blockchains used by coins like Bitcoin or Ether. The bread and butter of IOTA is the Tangle, which is IOTA's answer to the blockchain. On the Tangle, tokens can be transferred without any fees. This enables micropayments, which opens us up to a world where fractions of a penny can be transferred freely, quickly, and securely. Tangle's distributed ledger technology functions similar to a blockchain in that it uses a P2P network and validation mechanism, so it doesn't rely on a fixed central authority to maintain the ledger, but it does have some very cool advantages over the typical blockchain. One of the main differences is that there is no longer a concept of miners or a group of dedicated validators. Instead of achieving consensus through an expensive and rigorous mechanism, which ultimately leads to a degree of centralization, case in point Bitcoin, in IOTA, each network participant is active in the consensus and the validation of transactions. When a device makes a transaction and broadcasts the transaction to the network, by protocol, it has to validate two previous transactions. Since you are validating transactions when you make a transaction, you don't have to pay any transaction fees. In essence, you are the miner who helps validate the ledger. IOTA merges both the user and the validator into the same entity which is pretty awesome. Let's talk scalability. Tangle provides an architecture in which transactions can be validated in parallel instead of being limited to sequential blocks being added to a chain. This makes IOTA insanely scalable. And the cool thing is, the more the network grows, the more secure it becomes. IOTA's founders have a pretty cool vision for real world application, mostly involving the Internet of Things. The Internet of Things, IoT, is the inner networking of machines and software that use network connectivity to enable these devices to collect and exchange data. Let's look at a real world example. Let's say you are a farmer in a developing country like Kenya. A drought can break your family and community. Because of this, index-based rainfall insurance has emerged. Basically, insurance providers and farmers have begun adopting an insurance model where the farmers get paid if there is not enough rain in a season to have a successful crop. This model relies on data from local IoT weather stations which decide whether or not a payout is due. This is very efficient because it gets rid of the expensive and error-prone human component. However, because data is now the sole decider of whether money moves from party A, the insurance provider, to party B, the insured, there is a direct incentive for both parties to alter the data in their favor. Now there are essentially two methods that can be used to falsify data. The first is to censor the sensor, or to tamper with the device that is being used to collect the data. In our example, placing an umbrella over the sensor would falsify the data. The solution here, however, is pretty straightforward and effective, and that is to keep the location of the sensor secret and or monitored. The other method of falsifying data is to tamper with it after it has been put into a central database. With the push of a few buttons, an attacker can cause some serious damage. Well, Tangle seeks to solve this issue through guaranteeing data integrity by storing the data in a distributed and trustless fashion among the nodes in the network. It is now publicly auditable because everyone in the connected cluster has a copy of it. This gets rid of a single point of failure. It is now impossible for someone to alter the original data without the rest of the network seeing that it is now incompatible with their copy. Like the blockchain, data integrity is ensured, and the advantages over the blockchain are decentralization, scalability, and no transaction fees. There are a ton of potential uses for IOTA. Just imagine a car having its own wallet that automatically pays for the parking station, toll station, or charging station, and automatically earns income by renting itself out. Or a computer sitting on your desk could be automatically selling hard drive space or processing power to other computers on the network. In the near future, we can expect that a machine will be able to automatically pay for its assembly, its maintenance, its energy, and also for its liability insurance by giving data, computing power, storage, or physical services to other machines. For the first time in history, a device will be able to earn and spend money on its own, 
turning the machine into an entity that tracks revenue and expenditure from its own activities. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe, share it with your friends and family, help get the word out about cryptocurrencies. If you ever have questions or comments, we'd love to hear from you. So just leave them in the comment section below. We'll see you guys soon. Peace.